How to fix YouTube application sound delayed or lagging. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Bimu from App Guide, and in this guide video, I will simply show you the ways on how you can actually fix if the sounds on a YouTube application is actually delayed or lagging itself. But before we get started, as always, if you're new to our channel, then make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and without any further ado, let's get started with today's video. Now, there are a couple of reasons why this could be happening. Let's say that you're watching YouTube and then you simply face any kind of normal errors, such as your sounds are delaying, your sounds are lagging, and so on. Well, if that's the case, then make sure to watch this video till the end now the very first thing we will do is we'll simply open up app store and simply verify whether our youtube application has an update available or not so in order to do that in the search box i'm going to go ahead and then type in youtube once you type in YouTube, simply check if the YouTube app has an update available. As you can see right in this case, if you supposedly see a YouTube application right over here, and if you see an update button there next to YouTube instead of the open button, it means that your application needs an update, and which also means that you would simply need to update your YouTube app to the latest version. If this solution helps fix the issue, that is perfectly fine. If not, then we'll move on to the second solution. And that is that we will simply offload the app. In order to offload the app, I'm going to open the settings app. Once I open up settings, I will go ahead and then select the option which is general and as I select general, you'll be able to see a bunch of various options. I will go ahead and then select iPhone storage and on the list of these storage apps, you'll go ahead and look for the app called YouTube. So as you can see right in this case, I will tap on YouTube. As I tap on YouTube at the very top, you can see this button which is offload app, tap on offload and then tap on the offload app button again and simply verify and then try try to reinstall the application and see if your issue has been fixed if it doesn't the last thing and the final thing we can do is to simply restart our phone so press and hold the power volume down button as well as the power buttons together so i will press and hold those two buttons as well once i press it you can see it says slide to power off all what we have to do is simply slide this toggle which is at the very top of the screen in order to power off our iphone and hopefully that will have fixed the issue. We hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you have any more questions, queries or doubts, simply also make sure to leave them down below. Thank you very much for watching till the end and see you soon in our next video.